Okay guys, so the official patch notes have gone live for the new update that did go live recently just for Ark Survival Evolved on the Xbox, PC and the PlayStation. Obviously by now you guys will be enjoying Turkey Trial 6. I've been enjoying it a lot, obviously seeing the return of the Dodo Rex and the Super Turkeys. But reading through the patch notes with all the other stuff that has been changed, all the bug fixes, all the changes, so I hope you guys do enjoy. As always, if you guys wouldn't mind dropping a like on today's video, it supports the channel more than I can explain. Subscribe if you're new around here and let's get in with the patch notes. Now the patch notes are exactly the same as always on the PC, Xbox and PlayStation. So that's why we're just reading through the PC patch notes. So obviously Turkey Trial 6 is live. This event can be manually activated with the server perimeter active event equals Turkey Trial. Um, at the end of the video, I'll go through what's come out with Turkey Trial, but I'm sure loads of you guys have seen Marvel videos but we're mainly here for the other bits of patch notes so smelting chibis requires the placement of new refining forge now in the game so that's something you guys will want to watch out for when doing this in arc survival evolved crafting new chibis requires the placement of a new cooking pot so these are the two new changes that wildcard have worked with chibis if you have been wondering what's been going on or how what you know if anything's changed or not working for you those two are what you want to watch out for so crafting new chibis requires the placement of a new cooking pot wishbones are no longer able to be transferred attempting to transfer wishbones will result in them being deleted so do not now try and transfer any wishbones in the game otherwise anything you have obtained will get deleted from the game guys so that's a real heads up there if you are collecting wishbones at the moment and uh, you don't want to lose because if you transfer all of them they imagine everything all the hard work you put into could be gone so that's that's a heads up there to anyone that's trying to do that so the car car has um, had a fixed of losing taming affinity on sp restart so I know there's been the odd few problems with the car car with spawning and uh, but it's, so now they have fixed it not losing taming affinity on SP restart so that's just if you guys want to know on the car car I think it's at a pretty good state at the moment if you guys have any other problems with the car car in the game let me know it's always worth submitting to wildcard but for me, I think it's in a pretty good place right now. Um, I think because in another update, they actually fixed it disappearing on Genesis, um, which was then fixed. So added fear evolved cosmetics to the hexagon exchange. So like I've said in every single video, guys, you know, it is the last event. I know so many people get really upset when I mention that in the videos and say, why would wildcard do this you know everything like that but if you want to check back to an older community crunch i'll have to double check my good friend gp who's another youtuber actually put it in my comment section yesterday uh to someone saying they wildcard have announced it they've said it on twitter there are this is the final year of arc events for arc one that doesn't mean that there won't be more arc events on the second game i'm pretty sure there will be um i, I doubt they'll just be finishing that off so but they might have new names might not be called fear evolved anymore it might be called halloween evolved i don't know but i prefer fear evolved don't call it fear. halloween evolved so they've now added all of the cosmetics the hexagon exchange so throughout any time in the future when let's say next year comes around and you wanna and you're playing arc one instead of arc two you might be on the playstation you can get all those cosmetics from the hexagon exchange any event any time of the year even if it's valentine's day you can get that all from a hexagon exchange added purchasable random chibis at higher tiers in the hexagon exchange so a few things there with the hexagon exchange being added um just thought i'd let you guys know that within the update and they also fixed an exploit which was fixed that's why transfers were disabled a couple of days ago on the xbox and pc if you guys didn't know what was going on there they had disabled them for a day and a half just because there was an exploit with transfers going on so that is the full patch notes for everything that has come out within the new turkey trial update i'll quickly just zoom through this just because you, i'm sure you've seen it already um wildcard also tweeted turkey trial 6 is now live on all platforms until wednesday the 7th of december craft your very own fashionable turkey costume ugly sweater skins or choose to sum summon the devastating dodo rex creature to do your bidding for a limited of time now again that's uh that's what i said in yesterday's video we talked about this is the last event the dodo rex will be around for on arc one as as i said in the videos yes you can still you'll still be able to summon it there'll be mods and everything so you won't it'll 
The Dodo X won't ever be completely gone, but for official servers, this will be the last time you will be able to use the Dodo Rex. So make sure that you're getting involved with that. So the event details, as I mentioned, it started on Tuesday the 20th, or was that Wednesday, sorry? It started, uh, no, yeah, it was Tuesday, the 22nd of November, and it ends Tuesday the 7th of December. Now watch out for the December the 8th day. Remember, um, I will be doing a stream for Game Awards, um, uh, which is going to hopefully be some big ARC 2 stuff. Uh, so make sure to all get involved in the stream. The official rates are times three on official servers, 4.5 on small tribes, five on ARC Apocalypse, and five on Conquest. Event creatures, obviously the Super Turkeys have returned. The Dodo Rex has returned, as we mentioned. Um, there's a bunch of new ugly sweater skins. The, tur the official turkey costume is back. Um, and so you've got all these different new skins. The Pitchfork is back, the Chieftain hat skin. All of that is now within uh, obtainable in the game. Um, the new event Chibis is the Lymantria, the Mosasaurus, the Fjordhawk, Tech Strider, and the Stuffed Glowtail. So these are acquired via killing Super Turkeys for Wishbones. So they're all the new event Chibis where you can add to your collection. Um, and then you can get still get the Thanksgiving Dino Candy. I actually wanted to say, uh, you know, Happy Thanksgiving to anyone that is celebrating that, uh, that watches my channel. Um, and obviously Wishbones uh, through the so Super Turkeys. The new wild uh, creature colors, you've got uh, um, light yellow, um, dark turquoise, lemon lime, teal, cyan, light red, yellow, orange, dark blue, and the returning colors of black sands, midnight blue, vermilion, dark violet, dark magenta, medium autumn, light autumn, burnt sienna, dark, uh, dino darker gray, black red, near black, dino albino, uh, dark, uh, sorry, dino dark red, dark red, and brown. So that is everything which is live now for the game. Enjoy it up until Wednesday the 7th of December, guys, because as I mentioned, it will be the last time Turkey Trial will be available on the Arc 1 platform. It's been a fantastic last six events over the seven years of the game. I've loved every single minute of it, and I think it's actually nearly eight years of the game. I think that's coming up next year, though. So it will be a solid seven to eight years of Arc and a solid six years of Turkey Trial since this game was first released so thank you for watching smash that like button subscribe if you're new to the channel and we've got some really really awesome videos building up to what an exciting end to the year for arc survival evolved thank you for watching leave a like see you guys later mm -hmm. mm. Uh-huh.